So you're thinking about solar panels for your home, or maybe you already have solar panels, but you're not sure if it makes sense to purchase a high-priced home backup battery. In today's video, I'm gonna be teaching you about a new technology that allows you to use your electric vehicle as a home backup battery so you can save thousands compared to a traditional home battery. The smarter way to go solar. All right, now in today's video, we're talking about bi-directional electric vehicle charging and how you can use your electric vehicle as a home backup battery, uh, and also to shift loads to avoid incurring peak rates from your utility. Now, when we talk about bi-directional EV charging, what we mean very simply is that the connection between your home's electrical system and your electric vehicle is a two-way connection. So you can pull electricity from the grid or maybe from solar panels on your roof, and send that into the battery to charge the battery in your car. But under certain circumstances, you may also wanna be able to pull energy out of the electric vehicle battery, either to avoid having to buy expensive power from the power company, or maybe it's a grid blackout and you wanna be able to keep the lights on within your home without having to buy a separate, more expensive home battery system. And so that's what we're talking about when we talk about bi-directional EV charging. Now, those of you who've been following the channel for a while, you'll know that a number of the leading solar equipment manufacturers are offering bi-directional EV chargers as part of their suite or as part of their ecosystem. Um, in fact, if you haven't seen the previous videos, go back. We had videos about the Solar Edge bi-directional charger. Uh, of course, I went to Enphase's lab in Fremont, California. Enphase is also developing a bi-directional EV charger. Uh, and of course, Tesla with te the Tesla Cybertruck announced that same technology as well. Now, what are some of the advantages of using an electric vehicle battery as opposed to a traditional home battery? Well, the big one is cost. If you look at the total cost per kilowatt hour of a home battery, it's three to four times the amount of your electric vehicle if you already have the electric vehicle. So the way I would think of it is, you know, let's say you have a Tesla Model 3, maybe a Tesla Model S, that's already sunk cost that you've sunk into the vehicle. But if you could tap into that battery, which could be 70 to 100 kilowatt hours of energy storage capacity in that battery, then that's tens of thousands of additional cost you could avoid if you had to buy that same amount of storage in a home battery system. For example, like a Tesla Powerwall or maybe a point guard home battery stack. So that's why bi-directional EV charging is such a game changer is because it gives you the advantages and the flexibility and, and, and frankly the energy independence of having a whole house battery without having to buy a separate battery. All you have to buy in this case is the bi-directional charger and have it integrated with your home solar and energy system. Which is a great time to introduce today's video sponsor, Qmerit. If you're looking to live a more sustainable lifestyle, lower your energy footprint and become more energy independent, then Cumerit is the home electrification partner for you. Cumerit is our preferred home electrification partner, offering installation of bi-directional EV chargers, smart electrical panels, solar panels, battery storage, generators, and high efficiency heat pumps. Many of our clients start with solar panels or electric vehicles, then progress to whole home electrification. So if you're serious about becoming energy independent, and you wanna work with a qualified and trusted partner, then click the link in the description below so you can learn more about Powerhouse by Qmerit and get in touch with an installer right away. Thank you Qmerit for supporting the channel and for sponsoring today's video. Now, if you have a high capacity electric vehicle battery, you have a couple of use cases for it, okay? So the first is gonna be peak load shifting or peak rate avoidance. Now, for those of you who are watching this from California, Arizona, you know what I'm talking about here the power company charges you a much higher rate of electricity during peak rate hours. Typically it's between 4 p.m. to 9 p.m. And this is when there's the greatest demand for electricity. People are coming home from work, they're plugging their vehicles into charge, they're firing up the oven to cook dinner, maybe they're doing some laundry. Uh, of course, the air conditioner is working the hardest because it's all that you know afternoon high heat. And, and so in order to avoid having to purchase electricity from the power company during those hours, you could in theory just draw the necessary energy out of your electric vehicle battery, run the air conditioner, the water heater, the stove off of the electric vehicle battery's stored energy, and then you could charge the electric vehicle back up after you went to off peak hours, which is typically after midnight are gonna be your lowest, your lowest rates. So that's one use case. The second use case is for whole house backup. Uh, again, electric vehicle batteries are very high capacity. 70, 100 kilowatt hours. In the case of the Chevy Silverado, they even have an option over 200 kilowatt hours of battery storage. 
And so that's enough to run your entire house for multiple days during an extended blackout. So by having a bi-directional EV charger, it gives you that high capacity whole house backup, again, without having to buy a separate home battery or a separate home standby generator. So this is why bi-directional EV charging is such a game changer for solar. Uh, and of course, guys, one of the trends that we're seeing is it's not just solar and batteries anymore. It's everything becoming an integrated smart home energy management system, which could include solar panels, it could include home battery storage, could include electric vehicle battery storage. It could even include a fossil fuel burning backup generator. And it also includes intelligent controls for things like your HVAC and your water heater. So everything is working together seamlessly. So this has been a discussion of bi-directional EV charging. Uh, folks, as always, if you're getting good value from the videos you watch on Solar Surge, make sure you give us a thumbs up uh, and go ahead and subscribe to the channel as well if you haven't done so already. That way, as we have new videos like this coming out, it'll come up on your feed and you can stay up to date with us. Now, of course, if you're a homeowner, if you're in the process of looking at different solar and battery storage options for your home, uh, if you need to get a price quote or maybe you already have a price quote, you just need to get a comparison quote to make sure that you're getting the right equipment and getting the best deal, as always, feel free to reach out to us on the link below here. You can set up a call with a solar expert or just use the free online quote tool to see how much solar and battery storage costs in your area. Well, I thank you all for spending some more time on the Solar Surge channel. That does it for today. As always, I'm Joe Ordia here, encouraging you to get prepared and be empowered. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video.